So what's up everybody? I just want to say thank you so far to everyone that subscribed to me. I am almost at 100 and I know that doesn't seem like a lot because it's not, but it actually fires me up a lot because I did this not knowing what to expect. I just said I was going to do like a video every week about my life as a college athlete and to see that people actually want to follow that is pretty awesome. So thank you to everybody so far. So if you've been keeping up, you know that we just got back from Nashville. Obviously the coronavirus and everything going around, we've been on lockdown, have not really been doing a whole lot. I've been trying to keep busy doing things, working out, video stuff on my computer, a little bit of homework. I'm also going to be starting online classes on Monday, so that'll keep me busy. With that being said, I'll do my best to keep this video as entertaining as possible, show you guys what I've all been doing on these boring weeks, and let me know if you've been doing anything cool too, maybe give me some ideas. With that being said, Here's what a typical day of quarantine looks like for me. All right, it's about 8.30 now. I'm ready to start my day. I'm gonna be making three eggs and a bowl of oatmeal for breakfast. with some healthy fats and you're good to go. If you're looking for a way to make your oatmeal taste a lot better, I highly recommend the natural peanut butter. It's a lot healthier than brown sugar and it tastes great too. All right, so I'm done breakfast. I got my coffee. Now I'm just gonna spend some time on my computer doing any schoolwork, video editing, pretty much whatever needs to get done. So I've tried to implement in some yoga to my weekly schedule. Considering we have so much time right now, I might as well take that to my advantage. After the season, my hips and my hamstrings are always super tight, so it's important for me to fix that as soon as I can. o'clock I'm getting pretty hungry I'm gonna go back inside make some lunch and then come back in for a workout so I just got back from lunch I'm definitely very lucky to have a home gym especially during times like these where normal gyms are closed but if you guys need ideas for bodyweight exercises now that the gyms are closed even workouts I am an exercise science major so feel free to ask me because I would love to help you guys out with that okay so today I'm gonna to be doing a full body workout focusing on only compound movements so I'm going to be doing the squat, actually single leg squat, um, presses, and then deadlifting. I'm going to start off with the 5, 3, 2, 1 warm up and then get after it. To the wise, I'm a G, you don't know me. I just tripled last month in this whole week. Double time, 06, and an old G. Shorty kissing on my neck. So after the year, I always feel pretty weak from not working out enough during the hockey season. So I'm doing this style of workouts right now just to regain all that strength back that I lost throughout the hockey year. No me, I ain't grow up in the hood, ain't no thug life. Wow. But I grew up on a beach racing dirt bikes. Yeah. Had a couple of my friends, was a damn life. Why I look into the mirror every single night? Uh. Am I living for myself or am I living for you? Started so living every day and now I do what I do. I'm pursuing everything. Okay, that's it for the workout. Time to go inside, get a protein shake. I'll see you there. So it's the middle of the afternoon now. This is where things start to get a little random for me in terms of what I do the rest of the day. For today's sake, I'm gonna be working on another D1 versus D3 video. So I'll end this vlog with showing you some behind the scenes footage of that. Thank you for subscribing to me and getting me to 100 subscribers. It means a lot to me and I'll see you next week. Word to the wise, I'm a G, you don't know me. I just tripled last month in this whole week. Double time, 06 and an old G. Shorty kissing on my neck, said she know me. Word to the wise, I'm a G, you don't know me. I just tripled last month in this whole week. Double time.